Are you looking for a complete beginner's guide on the Say network? Well, in this video, we'll cover everything you need to know from setting up a Say compatible wallet, using a DEX to swap tokens, trading NFTs on leading marketplaces, finding those popular and new meme coins, as well as passive income opportunities, and so much more. So, before we begin, don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button, and let's dive straight into it. So, before we get started on the Sane Network, we wanted to share this incredible campaign over on Mexi, where you can earn yourselves up to 18,000 US dollars, of which you can do just by signing up and trading with Mexi, and this runs until the 28th of September, so if you want to get yourselves signed up, now is the time to start. Nonetheless, we're going to head over to the same network guys and the first thing that we're going to need in order to get started with the same network is a compatible wallet. And the one that I personally like to use is MetaMask because it is compatible with many networks. As you can see, we've got a whole bunch of different networks including the same network. So, you can see if we toggle the same network in MetaMask, you can then see that if we untoggle base, we've got the same network which appears and your tokens appear. Now, if you haven't got any say tokens in your wallet, we're going to show you how to get some in here. And therefore, if you head over to your MetaMask, you'll be able to first either A, go to the buy and sell option, which enables you to use the on-ramp option buying crypto directly to your wallet, so you don't have to use a centralized exchange or other third-party service. Here guys, as you can see, you'll be able to choose your network of which you can be able to buy crypto directly on. Say happens to be one of them and therefore you can buy cryptocurrencies directly through your wallet depending on your jurisdiction. However, we're going to actually use a different method and that is just by simply receiving cryptocurrencies directly from a centralized exchange. And therefore, we are now going to see my mobile pop up of which you will see my centralized exchange in this video. And now that you can see we've got my centralized exchange here, you can see my balance of 115 say tokens. What I want to do is I want to hit that withdraw button on the centralized exchange. And once you hit that button, you'll be able to see that we've got a few options that appear and I want to choose the external wallet. Next, as you can see, we want to add a new wallet address. And therefore, what we want to do is we now want to head over to MetaMask. We now want to head over to the receive section. Next, as you can see, we've got a little barcode. So on the centralized exchange, I'm going to get my barcode up and I'm just going to scan it. And as you can see straight away, the wallet address appears and you just need to very simply make sure it's the correct one. Once you've done that, you want to scroll down into all the details, the name, the country, X, Y, and Z. And then all you want to do is very simply withdraw the token. So you'll see in a second, it's going to skip and you're going to see the tokens appear in my MetaMask. Which, if you now go back, you can see that we've got our topped up say balance of which we've now withdrawn from our centralized exchange to our MetaMask, meaning that we've now got 268 say tokens. Fantastic. Now what's from here, guys? Well, now that you know how to get your tokens into the say network, we can begin and start exploring their world of Web3. And therefore, over on the Say Network website, you can see their ecosystem hub of which you'll be able to see all of the applications within their ecosystem. Here, guys, honestly, there are so many to check out. However, they've got their very own application of which we're going to show you. And this is the main hub of which you can use on the Say Network to swap, stake and do so much more. Now, once you're here, guys, as you can see, we're going to get ourselves logged in with the MetaMask of which we've just got our tokens on. And as you can see, we are now officially logging ourselves in and you'll be able to see the dashboard of which will show you your EVM address and your say address, as well as your balances, staked amount and so on. However, the next step that we want to show you once you've got yourselves logged in and acquainted with the say ecosystem, we want to show you how to swap tokens. And there are a few popular places to do so, but the one first place that we're going to show you is first over on DragonSwap, a popular decentralized exchange native to the say ecosystem. As you can see, if you were to get yourselves logged in, this is a very simple, sleek decentralized exchange where you can swap tokens, provide liquidity and even stake and much more. So here, for example, guys, if you wanted to swap your say tokens, which you can see here, we can swap them directly into dragon tokens or whichever tokens are available on the say ecosystem. So if we wanted to get ourselves USDC tokens down below, you can see we've got the say token up top, the token we are selling and down below USDC, the token we are buying. If I want to sell one say token for 30 cents or whatever, you very simply wait for it to load up, hit that swap button and boom, you're going to now see your token swap directly into USDC in a matter of seconds. That's exactly how to swap utilizing the Dragon Swap Decentralized Exchange. Now, what I will show you is, guys, another option of which is a cross-chain protocol, and you can utilize this platform to swap to and from the same network. It doesn't have to be just a native swap, native swap meaning just the same network. 
However, if you are interested in boosting your airdrop allocation for the jumper exchange, you might want to think about utilizing the jumper exchange protocol in order to swap and of course utilize this platform whenever you need it on the same network to qualify for airdrops such as jumper. So as you can see, we can head down to the same network once we find it. We can then choose our tokens. So as you can see, I'm going to choose say up top down below. Let's just say I wanted to swap into USDT zero. I can very simply choose an amount. As you can see, let's just say I swapped three say tokens. On the right hand side, it will come up with the best route possible. And you can see here that we can swap into USDT using the LiFi DEX aggregator. However, if for example, I didn't want to swap into USDT zero, but I wanted to swap into another network, let's just say, I don't know, it was the base network. I could actually swap into Ethereum tokens, for example, just by utilizing the gas.zip, which is integrated into Jumper Exchange. Basically, Jumper Exchange is an aggregator, so it finds the best swap and bridging routes for you so that you don't have to go scavenging Web3 for different applications. This is a nice, simple and beautiful platform, which will also help you qualify for the gas.zip airdrop. So I could do this. I could send over 90 cents to the base network if I wanted to. Bear in mind, this is just a guide, guys. I'm not telling you to do this. However, these are two platforms of which you can swap and bridge tokens with ease. However, moving on, the third step of this video, we want to show you how to get NFTs if that's something you are interested in. And although I don't believe that the same network is one of the most popular network for NFTs, for those who are interested, let me show you how. Well, we're currently over on Magic Eden, one of the largest NFT marketplaces out there. And as you can see up the top, we've got the Say Network. And if you want to swap and trade NFTs on this platform, guys, this is the place to do it. Unfortunately, I was over on OpenSea and they don't have any available NFT collections on the OpenSea platform. And therefore, the best place to find NFT collections on the Say Network, in my opinion, is going to be the Magic Eden NFT marketplace which you can see many different collections here. If this is for you guys, then by all means, take a look at all the different collections. I have no idea which ones are which, which ones are best, and which ones are even worth hodling. But I'll leave that for you guys to decide, and this is exactly how to find NFT collections. If, for example, you wanted to get yourself, I don't know, one of these Say Punks, I don't know if this is an official collection, by the way, you can very simply come over here, sweep the floor price, maybe. You can see that it costs yourselves 3.09 Say tokens to get one. All you need to do is get yourselves logged in. Once you're in, as you can see, you just hit that buy button or you make an offer depending on what you want to do i'm just going to quickly buy it guys this is just a guide i'm not telling you to buy one whatsoever once you've done that boom you confirm it and then you'll see in a few seconds that you'll get your nft and like i said this is not going to be for everyone so if you didn't want to get yourselves an nft no problem whatsoever but you can very simply then just list it for sale once you've got it by heading over to your profile of which you'll see on the right hand side and then you'll be able to see all the nft collections that come up here within your wallet however that's nfts in a nutshell my friends and now we're going to move on to the next stage of this video and that is going to be moving on to the passive income section and there are a few ways to earn passive income within the same network just like many other networks and that is going to be through first the staking option so if we head back over to the say app of which we were on earlier at the beginning of this video on the left hand side you can see the staking section and here guys this is not going to be liquid staking, so please bear that in mind. But you can very simply lock up your say tokens in order to earn an APR of an average of 4.12%, of which, please bear in mind, guys, is variable. Now, down below, if you want to stake to a validator, of which may be say zero, ever stake, A41, say one, whatever it may be. If you have a validator in mind, by all means, you can choose one. Please bear in mind there is a commission rate, so that is very important to understand. For those who don't know what a commission rate is, basically when you go to unstake your tokens, they will take a 5% commission fee. So for example, if I staked 100 tokens, they would take five tokens as a commission. And therefore, you will have to stake your tokens long enough to make the profit back so that the commission doesn't take most of the profits. However, you must also bear in mind that the lockup period will last 21 days and therefore you can't unstake your token for a minimum of three weeks once you started staking. But just as a guide, guys, I'm not going to do much. This is just showing you if you wanted to stake tokens, you choose one of the validators. Next, you choose an amount to stake. So it could be one, say, token, whatever you want. Boom. All you do is very simply send it off, give the page a refresh. And as you can see, we are now staking one say token with the say zero validator. We just come here to check up on our rewards, claim the rewards whenever you want, or you can very simply unstake your tokens, which can only be done after three weeks. 
My friends, that is very simply how to stake tokens after that. If you didn't fancy locking up your say tokens for staking guys, you also have another option through Silo. Now this isn't gonna be for everyone. It's a very under the radar protocol, so it's understandable if you don't want to use this. However, it's got a TVL of $27.65 million and therefore is one of the leading liquid staking protocols on say. So what liquid staking is, it basically enables you to stake say tokens without having to lock them up, giving you full flexibility to sell your tokens whenever you wish, or even use them in the world of DeFi to earn more yield. And therefore, if you wanted to do this, guys, all you're going to do is get yourselves logged in. If you wanted to use Silo, you're going to come here and very simply choose an amount that you want to liquid stake. As you can see, I can move three tokens into liquid stake tokens. And if you wanted to, you can also claim an APR boost rewards of zero ISA, which I haven't got. So I'm going to ignore that for now. But very simply, I'm going to liquid stake three say tokens just in a matter of seconds of which can be fully liquid and I can sell at any given time. So that's done, guys. Now I've liquid staked my tokens. If I ever wanted to withdraw them, I can very simply go to max and you'll see that we've got liquid stake tokens to withdraw straight away and we'll go back into our wallet. This is now ideally earning tokens in our wallet, guys, but if you didn't even want to hit that withdraw button, let me show you this. If we go over to drag and swap the decks that we were on earlier, give the page a refresh. As you can see, if we now go to the decks, go to our tokens. Now, if we give it a second to load up, you can see my ISA tokens, which are liquid stake. I can now choose these tokens to swap into USDC. I can now choose them to swap into any token available on the SAY network, as you can see here. You don't even have to go to the withdraw button or unstake button over on Silo Finance. It makes it so much easier when you have liquid stake tokens to move them around, sell them, or provide them as liquidity elsewhere if, of course, you wanted to do that. This is my preference, guys. It's entirely up to you what you guys decide to do. However, now that you know both methods of staking, both normal staking and liquid staking, what we're going to do is we're now going to move on to the next section of passive income, which is through liquidity provision. And what is this? Well, liquidity provision is basically on a decentralized exchange such as DragonSwap. And if, for example, I was to show you over on the pool section, here you can see a variety of different liquidity pools where people are able to swap, the people who are providing liquidity, and the fees from the people that are swapping. Simply explained, and now guys, let me show you how to participate. So for example, if you had Dragon tokens and Say tokens, you can participate in this pool and get yourselves up to 94.94% APR. Remember guys that it is a very volatile pool because it's got $905,000 in liquidity, which is not much at all. But if you wanted a less volatile pool, for example, guys, you can see this USDC to say, which has a $9.46 million liquidity pool, has a lot of volume, has a lot of fees, and has a beautiful APR 42.34%. This pool requires USDC and the say token. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm first going to show you that we need to swap tokens into USDC, and therefore I'm just going to select the token down below as USDC. I've already got $1.43. Just as a guide, let's just swap a few more tokens into USDC tokens. Once you've swapped your tokens and you've got your USDC, we can then head back over to the pool section. We can scroll down, select that USDC to say, as you can see here. Next, you can see everything about the liquidity pool with a little how-to. Nonetheless, we want to now create a position which we can see down at the bottom. So, what we want to do is, if, for example, I was to enter the maximum amount of USDC, automatically it's going to input the amount of say that we need. And therefore, you just head through the steps, guys. As you can see, we're just going to confirm it. Next, you create the position, and boom, we've officially supplied liquidity over on DragonSwap. And now, all we need to do is head over to the Manage Position section, and we're just going to wait for our rewards to come in. And of course, we just need to claim those rewards or just sell at any given time, which we can do down here. So we've got a liquidity balance, and if we want to increase it, we can add more by simply adding more. Or if we want to decrease it, we can remove it by simply choosing an amount to remove, and it will go back into our wallet. Please bear in mind, guys, that there are many risks when providing liquidity, and remember that we are not financial advisors, we do not give any financial advice, and always use a burner wallet if you feel more comfortable. But moving on, the last part of the passive income section over on Say Network, guys, we are now going to move over to Yay Finance. And Yay Finance is one of the leading lending and borrowing protocols of which we can provide assets in order to earn a nice stream of passive income. And as you can see here, guys, we want to first get ourselves logged in. As you can see, I'm going to be using MetaMask once again. After that, you can then see all of the tokens of which are available on the Say Network on the Yay Finance protocol, whether that's USDC, Say, I say the liquid stake tokens, wrapped ETH, wrapped Bitcoin, USDT, you see where I'm going with this. 
What you want to do is, guys, you want to select the token of which you would like to supply, if of course you want to do this. USDC has a fantastic supply of 10.19% APY, and therefore all you would need to do is ensure that you have USDC tokens, which if you don't, you can head over to Dragon Swap. You can then head back into the swapping section once again, swap into USDC, which is exactly what I'm going to do. Let's just get ourselves eight tokens this time. Swap it when you're ready. Once you've done that, we're then going to head back over to Yay Finance. We're then going to head over to USDC. And then on the right hand side, you'll be able to see the supply APY alongside the APR of the supply and the rewards. Nonetheless, once you're ready, you just want to very simply choose an amount. You can either drag this little bar here or you can very simply enter an amount manually. So let's just say, for example, I did one dollars of my USDC tokens. I'm going to very simply continue. As you can see, we are now going to move on with the step. I'm just going to move over my camera so you can see it properly, of which we now want to supply it finally. And that is going to be one dollar of which we are going to be earning 10.19 percent APY, of which is going to be completely passive lovely 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 now guys like i said you don't have to use this platform there are many ways to earn passive income on the same network this is just one of the methods and one of the simplest methods of which i personally believe however we'll leave that down to you guys to decide even if you don't want to earn passive income the options are always there however you know how to stake you know how to provide liquidity and you know how to lend out assets to earn passive income Moving on, from here guys, we just wanted to show you how incredible the Say ecosystem really is. You can see there are honestly so many different protocols down here in the ecosystem. However, if you were interested in gaming, you can see that they've got their very own specific gaming section, which down here, if you were to toggle it, you'll be able to see many different Web3 games of which you can play directly on the Say network. Some of these might be the best games ever, some of these might be the worst games ever as well, so please bear that in mind. However, you can see they've got a growing ecosystem of games, and some of which are on mobile, and some of which are on both browser as well. So find out if there's any games that may interest you, if this is something that you like. I believe Web3 Gaming is going to make a mega comeback. And taking a look at this, guys, honestly, they've got a huge ecosystem of games, of which could compete with many other fantastic gaming ecosystems. Not only that, but Sane Network could very well also be a fantastic choice for meme coins in the future. Right now, I'm not going to lie, it's not a good network for meme coins right now, but I could be completely wrong. However, in the future, guys, Say Network might be one of the most popular network for meme coins, and therefore you're going to want to stay up to date with everything that we've done in this video, ranging from all the protocols and, of course, any new protocols that may arise. However, after exploring the ecosystem, guys, you might come across many tokenless protocols. And in the future, we hope to provide you with many tokenless protocol airdrops of which may come on the Say network. Now, at the moment, I'm starting to deep dive into the Say ecosystem. So hopefully at some point, I'll find you some airdrop opportunities. But for now, guys, make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel because we will be back in the Say ecosystem. And if there's any content that you'd like to see in particular, you can let us know in the comment section down below. But I'm very fond of the Say ecosystem, although it's not my favorite right now. I would say that there are many great opportunities on here for you guys to check out. Not only that, guys, but we've got many other beginner's guides on the BNB chain, the Ethereum network, Solana, Base, you name it. We've got many on our YouTube channel. So if you're a complete beginner to Web3, make sure to check those out because you want to get started on as many popular networks as possible to get ready for that major alt season and bull run. Now, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. We appreciate every single one of you who does, and we can't wait to see you in the next video.